What's up guys, welcome to another edition of Market Marauders. Uh, today we're we'll giving an update on fuel cell energy. Um, so the market's still open right now on the 9th and the current trading price should just change is 34 cents. Uh, so let's dive into and give you all update on what's going on in the company. So on the 15th, uh, they announced that you know sub uh, megawatt solution for a European market. So basically, they're just explaining, you know, that there says we are excited to expand our presence and use of fuel cell solutions in Germany, Italy, UK, uh, Benelux, France, and Spain. Uh, distributed power generation markets. So basically, they're just saying that they're expanding, you know, their power, their uh, sure source technology uh, fuel cells to other markets throughout the, the world basically showing that they're going to be a, a worldwide company well, you know, which is fantastic um, to know the problem that we had before was you know this company has so many orders that they had that they just hadn't filled all of them but you know they have a really good product and really good uh, solution to you know the problem of you know not having efficient uh, energy coming to different places so basically you know their product is good but they just don't can't meet the demand of having all the orders backed up so um, next we're going to go to uh, the fuel cell energy celebrates 9 million uh, megawatt hours of clean power generation uh, so this was just recently. This was on the 5th of August. Um, it says, we're proud, to pro proud of the progress we've made developing cleaner and more energy efficient electrical power solutions, answering the need to both utility scale and behind the meter applications. So, you know, it says, read this for you all. It says, a global leader and delivering clean, innovative, and affordable fuel cell solutions for the supply, recovery, and storage of energy. Today announced reaching a significant clean power generation milestone with a total of more than 9 million megawatt hours having been generated by SureSource fuel cell power plants globally since the first commercial installation. So if you don't know, uh, the SureSource is basically their little mini factory that they have that generates power. So these are the different ones. Uh, there's the SureSource 1500, which is 1 1.4 megawatts. There's SureSource 3000, which is 2.8 megawatts. And there's the SureSource 4000, which is 3.7 megawatts. Um, so basically they're saying, you know, with all the facilities that they've built combined uh, between these three different uh, facilities that they have generated, nine over nine million megawatts which you know is pretty impressive um and just shows that they're steadily growing um and fulfilling the orders that they have um that number is only going to go up because i mean going over last uh of their financials from last uh video that i had you know they were doing pretty good and they had a lot of orders that were stacked up so you know they're they're showing to be really profitable in the long run um so, you know, I think they're on the right track and, you know, just showing that they're, they're actually getting it done. Um, so, you know, comment on your thoughts to see uh, what do you think about fuel, fuel cell energy and, you know, where it'll go in the future and to see if, like, this could be something you could see, you know, in your local community or, or something, uh, you know, at a local hospital or you know, like a university or something. Uh, is this a product that actually you can see being implemented uh, around the world? Um, so just drop a comment below. Uh, make sure you subscribe. Uh, click down below as well. Uh, give it a thumbs up. And let's start the conversation about fuel cell. Um, it's been another episode of Mark Marauders. Uh, see you all next time.